Atlanta Club, where two people took their last breaths. It is temporarily closed. The 1145 Lounge in Buckhead agreed to shut down until August 1st. That decision follows a tragic night back in May. Mary Crichton and Nikaris Ridley were shot and killed at the venue when a gunman opened fire inside the club. And overnight, one man turned himself in on murder charges. Atlanta News First, Patrick Quinn is live tonight outside that club in Buckhead. And Patrick, the decision to temporarily close the club is part of a larger legal battle. And that battle is ongoing. Now tonight, just within the last few minutes, the mayor, Andre Dickens, just released a statement applauding this decision to temporarily close this nightclub. However, he wants it closed for good. And now today there was a court hearing around this. It was postponed and moved to August, but this club will be temporarily closed until August 1st. Meanwhile, the family of one of the victims, they say the shooter and the club are to blame for a young girl's death. With the help of her friends, sister or father we just all you know just coming together and just just trying to be strong and be there for Mari and just fight for her the best way that we know how the family of Mari Creighton shot and killed May 12th inside the 1145 lounge demanding accountability on the steps of the Fulton County Courthouse we want justice we want justice overnight 21 year old Karanji Reese turned himself in as a suspect in the shooting Reese now facing charges of murder but Mari's family says it's the Buckhead nightclub that should also be held responsible for Mari's death. They allow people to come into their establishment with firearms and now my sister isn't here and my family will never be the same. The family showed up to court to support the city of Atlanta's legal push to shut down the club. That hearing was rescheduled, but in the meantime, the solicitor's office said owners of the 1145 lounge agreed to stay closed until the newly set August 1st hearing. The club did not respond to my request for comment, but said in a May 30th statement, quote, it is very alarming to witness the continuous racial targeting of black owned establishments. The current efforts to shut down the establishment stem from its urban atmosphere and diverse clientele, which deviate from the Buckhead community's norms. To issue a blanket statement on racism that was really offensive to me because someone that looks like me killed my daughter. And again, Mayor Andre Dickens just released a statement around this ruling to temporarily close the nightclub. He added in part, no one should lose their life going out to have fun. After this incident, I said there are several tools at our disposal and we will not hesitate to leverage any of them to keep our community safe. Again, we reached out to ownership here at 1145 Lounge. We have not heard back. From Buckhead, Patrick Quinn, Atlanta News First. Tonight, Atlanta